Hello everyone and welcome and thank you for clicking on this video. So today's video is inspired by the latest pack we got and that is Eco Living. And so we got that pack like three weeks ago, I think. And so for those three weeks or maybe four, I didn't build anything. I didn't film anything. I didn't do anything with the game. And that is just because I always feel uninspired whenever a new pack comes out because I am not able to buy it right away and that is one thing that is so frustrating because I know that people will mostly focus on you know the new pack everybody is excited about it and you know everybody would you know just want to watch videos about the pack and builds um, that include that pack and everything so i don't really want to make videos then because like i said i am uninspired and i don't know what to build because i don't own the pack and so i still don't own it but i got some of the money and so i bought the university discover university and so this build includes Discover University. Um, it is not limited, so I'm really sorry, but whenever um, I am building, I'm trying to, you know, limit myself, but this time I just didn't. And so I saw this house um, on Instagram, I think, and it was kind of like eco, you know, <laughs> It was giving me eco vibes, so I just wanted to build it in The Sims as well. And so, um, since we don't have like a lot that is um, very small, like even smaller than 20 by 15, um, I decided to do two houses. And so I named this lot Eco Neighbors. And so as you can see, the, both houses uh, look the same, but the interior is different. And I was trying to make them more different like um, from the inside but also kind of in the outside but yeah so as far as the front it is the same <laughs> but the backyard is kind of different but it's not really fully different um, I hope you know what I'm saying but yeah like I said, this is eco-inspired, so um, ever since they announced that we will be getting an eco-friendly, you know, expansion pack, first of all, I wasn't that excited because I don't think that that should have been an expansion pack because, you know, I feel like we have a lot of items already in the game to make, like, eco-friendly builds and everything, so it's more for gameplay than, you know, an overall um i would say game uh, but yeah we got a new world and we got a lot of build and buy items that i really really like and i to be honest can't wait to buy the pack i'm just waiting for it to be on sale because it is more affordable to me um but like i said i can't wait to buy it and to make builds with it and so yeah the whole point is that ever since they announced it i've been finding myself you know building a lot eco friendly um builds and so you will probably get a lot of builds um, in the next few weeks that are eco related and i'm really sorry but i really you know i really like the the colors that i use whenever i build in this type of style and um you know i i really i really enjoy it i really like it and maybe that is an excuse for me to you know um use a lot more plants in the houses that i'm building but yeah i just i just love to build with it and so this is the backyard as you can see and so it's not really big it's kind of the same but it's also not um as you can see i've been trying to um not make them look the same so i added this kind of greenhouse i would say i think yeah i think that's what it's called um to this house because um yeah i just wanted to also i just wanted to use that window we got with laundry day i think it's perfect for you know greenhouses so <laughs> That's why I've used it and also there is a lot of um, debug objects, objects in this 
lot so yeah but I can't really tell you what packs that I've used um, I don't own all of them so there isn't a lot of packs that I've used but um, yeah you will see it on the gallery when you um, go download it um, my gallery ID is semi grimy so if you want to download this house, you can find it there. Um, I think it's called Eco Neighbors and that's it. And also um, with the new update, um, actually when I was building, I forgot that we got um, ladders um, and you will probably see me using it in my next build. But yeah, I forgot to add them here, even though there isn't well, I didn't actually know where to add them, but I forgot that they were there. And also when I was using the windows, um, I also forgot that we got the update when we can freely, you know, freely move them. Um, so yeah, that was exciting. <laughs> um, and as you can see, I am doing the front of the houses. And to be completely honest with you, I think that these are the best parts um, about these houses. I really like how it turned out. It is kind of small, but it also feels very cozy. It has a fountain and plants. And as you can see, for one house, I decided to go with sofa and for other house I decided to go with you know table and chairs but overall I think that it turned out pretty amazing and I really like that part of the house um, and I would rather live there than anyone else like I think that this is um, my I would say dream home like I really like how it turned out and so yeah but as you can see this is the backyard so I've tried to use that solar plants plants what um, panels um, from the get famous and I kind of thought that um, the ones we got with eco living I kind of thought that we already got them and so I was really convinced that I would use that here as well but yeah I guess not and so I've tried to put as much as I could in this lot even though it doesn't really I couldn't put them on the roof so yeah I'm, I'm it's kind of not looking good by the side of the fences outside but yeah I didn't know where else to put them so and this is the inside for the first house and this kitchen is kind of awkwardly looking um, but I will change that later on you will see in the process but as you can see the stove is in the middle of the island but everything works I've tested um, so as far as I'm concerned everything worked for me at least so yeah but I didn't talk about the houses and what they got so this house has two bedrooms and no two bathrooms and <laughs> three bedrooms so um, one one of the bathroom I think I think that it's called like a half a bathroom just because it only has a toilet so um, the bathroom is downstairs like I said it only has a toilet so it's not really that important and like the other house it has that as well like one toilet downstairs and then the full bathroom upstairs so the bathroom and this build I really really like because I really like the colors that I've used and the theme and everything so I think it worked out perfectly um, and so the bedroom so there is a master bedroom that leads to the balcony and then there is a kids room and a toddler room um, and the other house I think it has um, three bedrooms as well so the bo both houses have like a children's room and then the toddler's room so um, if you are living with a family that has toddlers and children's then this would be a perfect house for you but as well um, as always uh, you can change that you can change the um, rooms however you like whenever you download this house so that is um, up to you, but as you can see I've changed the kitchen. I've changed the layout I just think that this way it looks a lot more better even though I wanted to make this kitchen like bigger 
um, I just didn't um, so yeah and the living room as you can see I've in both of the houses I've used um, tiny living sofas just because I really I really like them and I really think that they fit really well with the theme that I was going for so that's why I chose them but yeah I think that's all I wanted to say about this build um, the video is probably going to be long um, like 20 minutes long just because I'm decorating both houses and everything and I'm going to try to narrow it um, as much as possible but yeah we will see <laughs> what I've done um, and how long this video is going to be but I won't be talking throughout um, the rest of the video because I have I've actually built a lot of the I filmed a lot of the builds and houses that I made so I have a lot of videos to edit <laughs> and so yeah um, I will try to edit them um, as quick as I can and also you know I will have to do voiceovers and everything and I don't know if it if you guys think it's okay to sometimes post a video without a voiceover um, let, me, let me know what you think about that because sometimes it is way more easier to just put songs um, over the video and not talk because yeah um, but yeah let me know um, hopefully you enjoyed this video um, if you want to download it my gallery ID is Simi Creamy so you can download it there like I said already and uh, yeah I will see you in my next video bye
Find a way to get lost. So find a way to get lost. Yeah, we'll find a way to get lost. So find a way to. 